Oh. I see ya. Uh, boom. Oh, bollocks. Hey, did you get a shield on? I, I know what you one. need. Some throw. Oh, bollocks. Bollocks, bollocks, bollocks. Whoa. You know what I need? I need... Oh, no. Ah. Uh, I need some tech armor. That's what I need. Uh, oh, bollocks. Reload. Daka. Oh, no. Well, Morden got messed up, but he'll be fine. Oh, really? I die next. Now, oh, haha, <laughs> boom! Hi. Oh no. I see ya. I see you over there. You silly. Aha. No, you're not. No, you're not. Haha. You definitely didn't. There we are. Stun him. There we go. How the hell did they get messed up? Oh, okay. Well, there's a lot of transport stuff going on here. But where's the terminal that I can use? I don't know. I would like to know. Submachine gun. I'll take it. I'll take it. This looks valuable. We can use this. <laughs> oh, hi. Yeah, you don't say, Miranda. Uh, boom. Oh. <laughs> It's a statue of ice. There we go. That accuracy helps so much. That is so good. That's a wicked. <laughs> that is such a wicked upgrade. Overload deployed. Oh, is it? Hey, watch this. Ah, uh, bomb. Oh, there we go. Oh. Ah, uh, Loki makes like really cheap. I mean, do, do they go Roger Roger? There we go. And you know what we need? To... Oh, bollocks. Hi, 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 hi. I've got no shields. Yeah, you don't say, Shepard. Put your tech armor back on. This will Boom! Push down. <laughs> that was a wicked use of an explosive barrel. Hi. You're right. You're right. You're right. Oh, bollocks. There we go. Mess them up. And some warp. Yeah! Oh, bollocks. Nope. You're too far behind there. Oh. Well, that didn't work either. Oh. Come on. Kill it. There we go. Stupid Solarian. Nah, they're not stupid. Ah, fucking itches. Oh, just use the heavy pistol for now. Here we go. And some warp. Hello. Oi. Oh. Oi. Ha ha ha. Fucking kidney shot ended him. <laughs> if they have kidneys there, I'm not. I'm not so sure about that. I hope they do have them. That'd be a little bit weird otherwise. Look at all that ammo we have. Slam. Oh hi. Hello. Ooh, <laughs> I love throw way too much. Oh no. Yeah, don't don't do that. You don't want her getting her hands on anything, especially not on me. Oi, go away. That's difficult. Yeah, it's not more than. Ah, uh, boom. Oh, oi. Come on, more You can mess them up. Ah, uh, Zaka. <laughs> yes, it was. The best headshot ever. Except not really. I've done better headshots than that. Hello. Bam. And then... <laughs> I'm making a right mess of these. Yes, we do. Oi, you're a Solarian. You're stupid. Not really. Oi. I don't, I don't want to do it that way. Uh, whoosh. Thank you. Luckily, throw does a lot more damage now, so I can actually use it as, as an actual attack. <laughs> oh. Oh no. Oh no. There we go. But it's more more useful for really using it to debilitate the enemy. To deal extra extra damage. Stun him. There we go. Oh wham. <laughs> wham. There we go. Mass him up. Oh. They got a lot of stuff over there. Morden. Freeze them. 
Nice. That was the best freezing ever. Come on. There we go. Freezy pop. Virginia! Hanging out with little boys in spandex, I see. Yes. No, sorry. Yes. Why? <laughs> Mine. Well, I just fucked up my voice trying to do that. Because, uh... Well, it, I, I just did. <laughs> there's a, there doesn't need to be any other, other explanation than that. Right, so... We got any stuff around here? Yes, we do. Hacking. Ah, oh, more fucking credits. It's, it, it's just not worth it. It really isn't. Mine. Whoa, 100 fucking... Wow. That is over two mags. Pretty well worth it. Creaky. Ah, oh, thanks, ED. Wham. Watch out. Hi. Ah. You know what? What we need to do here? Freezy pop. That did do damage to his shield, though. There we go. Morden is so useful for that stuff, though. But so am I. Wham. I can do it too. I can do. Come on, all. Oh. You know what you need though? Some war. Oh. Well, it's ended before I could even do anything about it. Miranda, what? Aha! Messed him up. Thank you. Wash. <laughs> Blunt force trauma. I'm afraid it is. Story spoiler. Yoink. Thank you. Right. Maybe the captain knows we're listening in and she's feeding misinformation about Niket making a switch. Or maybe it means something else. Niket wouldn't do that. Damn it, why won't the thing go any faster? Are you serious? Like, are you sure about Niket? What makes you so sure that Niket wouldn't turn on you? He could have turned on me when I ran away. I'm sure my father tried to buy him off. If he didn't do it then, why would he do it now? Does he know about Ori Oriana? Did Niket know that you took Oriana from your father? No, he just found out about that recently. It was too personal to involve someone else. I never really thought about it, but maybe... No, he'd have to understand why I did it. He knows what I went through. Well... I'm sorry, Miranda. The message on the radio seemed pretty clear. He wouldn't betray me. We'll be at the transport shuttle in a moment and we'll clear this up. Loading screens. Oh, listen to me. I've got authorization to change their booking. I'm sorry, sir. We're under security lockdown. Until the situation in the cargo terminal is resolved, no passengers can be rebooked. This isn't worth my time, Niket. I get paid regardless of how the girl gets there. No. I was told that I could handle this my way. We're not traumatizing the family any more than we... Mary. This should be fun. <laughs> Niket. You sold me out. I'd say we kill him. Not many civilians around. We can end this here and now. Not before I get some answers. Why, Niket? You were my friend. You helped me get away from my father. Yes, because you wanted to leave. That was your choice. But if I'd known that you'd stolen a baby... I didn't steal her. I rescued her. From a life of wealth and happiness? You weren't saving her. You were getting back at your father. Why did you betray her, betray, betray her, Niket? How did Miranda's father turn you? They told me you kidnapped your baby sister all those years ago. They said I could help get her back peacefully. No trauma to the family. I told them you'd never do that. They could go to hell. And you finally told me what you'd done. I called them back that night. Why didn't you call me, Niket? We've been through a lot. You could have at least let me explain. I deserve to know that you'd stolen your sister, Miri. I deserve to know you were with Cerberus. But I had to hear it from your father first. So you sold her out. How much did Miranda's father pay you? A great deal. Damn it, Niket! You were the only one I trusted from that life. 
He knew you felt that way. That's why he bought me. So you just took his money? Don't get holy with me, Miri. You took his money for years. So... What about Oriana's new family? Whether or not you agree with Miranda, Oriana has been with her family for years now. Her father can still give her a better life. You don't know what my father wants for her. I know that I've been poor, Miri. I didn't much care for it. He wants to take a girl away from the only family she's ever known. Doesn't that tell you what he really is? So how is Enyala involved in this? I knew Eclipse was willing to get their hands dirty, but kidnapping a kid? I'm not stealing her. I'm rescuing her. Come on, Niket. Let's finish this bitch off and get out of here. Take your best shot. I was just waiting for you to finish getting dressed. Or does Cerberus really let you whore around in that outfit? Whoa. Well, can't hide her now. If Niket knows about Oriana, then your father does too. Relocating her won't work. Miranda's father has no information about Oriana. I knew you had spy programs in your father's system, Miri, so I kept it private. I'm the only one who knows. Which means that you're the only loose end. This isn't how I wanted it to end, Niket. I'm going to miss you. <laughs> Figuratively speaking. I was tired of talking anyway. So was I. Get Let's down! do it, Eclipse! Well, that was messy. I chose not to save Niket just because... Well, Greed overcame him. And that should be punished. Wow! Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Oh man, Enyala's fucking tough. Ain't you en Enyala? You're a tough bitch. Boom! And now, you know what I'm gonna do here? Throw! <laughs> I still love it. Oh, get back down. There we go. Oh, hi! Doing whack-a-mole, are we? <laughs> oh. Oh. Ah. Come on! I can mess you all up! No. Oh, god. Morden, freeze them! <laughs> I mean, I can use it myself, but Morden is the absolute best for that. He's got a wicked thingy. Boom! Get ready to fight. Yeah, do 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 that. Oh. Bollocks. Oh whoosh. <laughs> you okay? Oh. Get out of the way of that. There we go, Miranda, finish him off. Yeah. Got him. There could be more eclipse mercs near the shuttle. I wanna make sure Oriana and her family get on safely. Yeah, good idea. Good idea, Miranda move. Right, let's pick up some more stuff before we go. Hey, watch this! <laughs> I love throw, it's so fun to use. Although pull is probably more... Pull might actually be a bit more useful, but you know, throw is still fun. I can't believe Niket sold me out. I didn't even see it coming. You couldn't have. Even with all your upgrades, you're human just like the rest of us. But I let it get personal and I screwed up. Why did he make me kill him? He could have run. He could have lied about having the data stored somewhere. But he just stood there. The only loose end. He knew what I'd have to do. He thought you wouldn't do it. Maybe he didn't think you'd have the nerve to gun him down. No, he knew. All too well. Well, don't blame yourself. You did what you had to do, Miranda. You're not responsible for his death. Of course I am. But it's not my fault. It's not even Niket's, really. My father takes the blame. For all of this. It's always been like this. My father gave me anything I ever wanted. But there was always a hook. An angle for his long-term plan. I threw away everything he ever gave me when I ran. Except Niket. Weakness on my part? Is he that last loose end? Eh, last loose end? Any other old friends your father might use against you? No, I cut ties with everyone else. Anyone I'm close to now works for Cerberus. Or you. My father's powerful, but he won't cross the elusive man. Come on, let's go. Let's get moving. Right. Whoa! Slow or we'll topple an enemy. Boobs.
No sign of Eclipse. It looks like we're clear. There she is. She's safe. With her family. Come on, we should go. You don't want to talk to her? Don't you even want to say hello? It's not about what I want, it's about what's right for her. The less she knows about me, the better. She's got a family. A life. I'll just complicate that for her. You really should speak with her, though. She doesn't need any details, but would it really be so bad for her to know she has a sister who loves her? I guess not. Go on. We'll wait here. We're not going to use Miranda, so we won't get to use that. Oh, ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I've always quite like, liked that uh, loyalty mission. Very combat heavy, but it's all, always been kind of fun. But it's like for Garrus' one, I didn't really like the factory uh, combat section that much, but the actual bit where you get to Sedonis, I, d I really like that, that part quite a lot. Um, how many more do we have to go? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Um, hmm. I guess we'll go and do Jacob and Kasumi. Yeah, let's do those two. I really like Kasumi's one though. Open up, it's the police. Oh no, the police, oh fuck. Yeah, you better be running scared. A little bitch. Oh, 84,000. Alright. How nice. Let's do it. Tech damage. Mine. Thank you very much. Thanks very much, man, isn't it? Oh man. Whoa, so many credits. Fuck up. Out the way. Out the way. Ah, let, let's talk to her, shall we? Pardon me, I'm dealing with damn Ilium travel bureaucracy. I found this. Excuse me, but I found a locket with a picture of a human and someone who looks like you. Oh, Stephen. Thank you. Thank you so much. My daughter was young when he died. This is the only memento she has of him. Please accept this. It's much less than I would have had to pay the bureaucrats to authorize a search. There seriously isn't enough Stevens in in video games. Like you hear a lot of a lot of other names and all that, but Steven is seemingly one of those that that is never used. If I made a, a main character in a video game, I'd call him Steven Baxter. I don't know why, I just will. Oh, I don't think we've seen this uh, cutscene yet. Flying away from Idiom. Fly on the wings of love. Whoa! Fuck you, Ilium. I'm getting the hell out of here. Yeah, do do that. That is a very good idea to get the fuck out of there. But but you know what? Whatever. Huh. Export your save games to Mass Effect Three if you survive. Are you questioning my no messages for you, skills? Oh, okay. Really, nothing. Oh fuck. Well, I want to go and talk to Miranda and Morden. Hello, Morden. You okay, my dude? Shepard, how can I help? By talking to me, of course. Have you got a minute to talk? Actually, wanted to talk. Medical matters. Aware that mission is dangerous. Different species react differently to stress. Sexual activity, normal stress release for humans and Turians. Still, 
Recommend caution. Warn of chafing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I imagine Garrus is very rough. Um, give me your ad your advice. You have a recommendation as a doctor? Turians based on dextral amino acids. Human ingestion of tissue could provoke allergic reactions. Anaphylactic shock possible, so don't... <clears throat> Ingest. <laughs> also forwarding advice booklet to your quarters. Valuable diagrams, positions comfortable for both species, erogenous zone overviews. Can supply oils or ointments to reduce discomfort. Gave ED electronic relationship aid demonstration vids to use as necessary. Hey, <laughs> you're joking with me, are ya? Wait a minute, Morden. You're just yanking me around, aren't you? Shocking suggestion. Doctor-patient confidentiality, a sacred trust. Would never dream of mockery. Enjoy yourself while possible, Shepard. We'll be here studying cell reproduction. Much simpler, less alcohol and mood music required. <laughs> God damn it, I love you, Morden. I love you, man. I wanna have sex with No I wanna I wanna have it. No messages for you, Commander. Oh thanks. I want to have it with Garrus baby. Oh, I love him. Let's see if Joker has anything to say. Can you tell me stuff, Joker? I really want to know. Take a good look at my ass. So, Commander, you figure Miranda would ever lighten up a bit and... No, I can't even finish saying it. <laughs> I assume everything's going well up here? Good for now. Oh, God damn Fractured it. my thumb. That's it for See now, you stop fracturing your fucking thumb, Joker? He does that all the time. It's like mute button, ow. Mute button, ow. Mute button, ow. Oh my god, my, my bone is literally just a million little pieces. Fuck. Whatever. Um, uh, Miranda. Let's go and talk to Miranda and my Garrus baby. Oh, Garrus. Oh yes, Garrus. Oh, I love him. I love him so much. Hello. Thanks again, Shepard. Taking the time to help me with my sister. I couldn't have reached Ariana in time without your help. And you proved yourself trustworthy. Unlike Niket, I'm glad I got to take him out myself. So, what about Ariana? Are you happy about your sister's relocation? She has what I wanted her to have. A normal life, and the freedom to choose her own path. And she knows she has an older sister. A friend. Will you stay in touch? Are you gonna talk to her again? I honestly don't know. For once, I haven't planned that far ahead. I'll deal with it after our mission. I have to stay focused and she needs time to adjust to her new home. I'm glad I could help. Let me know if I can do anything else. I think I got it from here. My father has no chance at finding her family in their new location. But thank you, Commander. My sister is safe again thanks in large part to you. I won't forget that. Thanks, Miranda. Jeez, you're pretty great. And you get a nice look at my great ass on the way out. Now let's go to my baby. Oh, baby. All right, Garrus. Hi. Shepard, need me for something? I just want to talk. Have you got a minute? Definitely. Part of me still thinks we're crazy for even considering blowing off steam. But I want to try it with you. I want a few moments that are just for us before we throw ourselves into hell for the good of the galaxy. I feel the same way, dude. I want that too, Garrus. Glad to hear it. I'll do some, uh, research and figure out how to, you know. <laughs> okay, that sounded bad. <laughs> you wouldn't think he would be so nervous about it. Usually, because Garrus has a is quite is a quite quite a confident fellow. It, it, it's just kind of funny. <laughs> oh, Garrus, I want him. Ah, oh, his sexy Torian dick in my no. Stop talking about that. Stop being so shit. Um, let's go for. Jacob. Jacob. 
Yeah. Go for Jake on the orb and grow. It's pretty awesome if I do say so myself. Hey, Alpha Draconis. Or Alpha Dragon. It's a dragon star. That's how cool it is. Oh no. Now that sucks. Aya. Let's go to Aya. Oh no. Named after an Asari scientist, this remote planet appears to have been on the list of forbidden mass relays that led to Uncharted's base. The little data available comes from one far-off probe flyby that reports two planets orbiting a white dwarf star. Your own scans yield far more interesting results. The planet is within the habitable zone of the star. It has oceans of liquid water and a thin nitrogen-oxygen atmosphere, which we breathe, consistent with carbon-based plant life. It is possible this is an, an as-yet unexplored garden world. BAM! Oh. Oh no, not, not exit. Fuck, I was meant to press Y. Man, I'm so shit. Oh, we can do a little bit of... Yeah, why not? See if we can find some iridium. Now, trust me, this isn't... You're gonna see very little planet scanning from me. And this is probably gonna be the last one. Maybe. <laughs> but I'm gonna spare you a bit otherwise. I feel it's important to show it off just because... Well... It's so you see how bloody tedious it can get. And holy shit, it gets tedious. Uh, there. Oh my god, it like doesn't shut up. Fucking monster voice man. Um, anything? I want some meridium. Uh, sorry, iridium. God damn it. Give me iridium. I want everything iridium based. Ah, thank you very much. Yeah. There we go. Whoa! A few thousand. That's pretty dodgy and nice. Oh, balls. <laughs> that is a lot. That's a lot of stuff. And... Element Zero, I don't need it. <laughs> you start off with 50,000 if you've completed the game already. But, uh, believe me, you're not going to need any more. Any more than 50k. And chances are you'll, you'll have quite a lot in reserve. Fucking messages with their stupid voices. Oh, there we go. Let's go! I have research found projects. Yay. Element Zero is used for bioamp and Omni tool upgrades, which allow squad members who have biotic and tech powers to be much more effective. Thanks, ED. Bam. Ah. Yep, they can kill mechs pretty easily, but can also cause them to explode. As we've seen with the, the Amir mech when that went fucking nuclear in Garrus's loyalty mission. You remember that? Yeah, you remember that. You remember that? Wow, good. Right, let's see what you got, Jacob. Pull, incendiary ammo, and barrier. Um... Go with Morden again. Why not? Why not? Why not? Hmm, I do want a, want a more powerful cryoblast. But then again, I mainly use Morden for that. Whereas I like to use throw and warp ammo a lot. So I think it's important to focus on those two the most. As for you, my buddy. Let's get you. Bam. We want you to do tons of damage. Yeah. That'd be great. And... Yep. All of that. We want you to be pretty... Pretty powerful. Oh, okay. A bam. There we go. Um. Whoa, what the hell happened there? Okay, it just went really weird for a second then. Um, yeah. Neural shock again. Why not? Yep, that'll do. That'll do. As for you, Jacob, my buddy. My boy. Um. Stick you with that. 
Why not? Why not? Yeah, morning's always pretty, pretty good.